Welcome back! In the previous video I've shown you how I fitted a Raspberry Pi which runs OpenPlotter into my boat. Today we'll have a look how to integrate the Calypso wind meter into that setup. Enjoy watching! The Calypso wind meter has no moving or rotating parts because it has four ultrasonic sensors to calculate wind speed and direction. It is powered by solar and it uses a Bluetooth connection, so it comes without a cable. This circumstance makes it quite easy to install the meter in your mess top. You only need two screws or rivets, that's it. Since the built-in Bluetooth chip from the Raspberry Pi has a very short range, I'm using an external Bluetooth dongle from TP-Link, the UB500. It supports Bluetooth 5.0 and what makes it nice, it doesn't need extra drivers for the Raspberry Pi. Here you can see the current setup on the boat. We have the Raspberry Pi which has the MacArthur head stacked on top. The Raspberry Pi is connected via an Ethernet cable to the router. The wind meter is connected via Bluetooth to the Raspberry Pi. And you can connect to OpenPlotter using any device which supports Wi-Fi. Later an NNMEA 2000 bus will be installed and the signals will be routed through that bus as well. The Bluetooth dongle will be plugged in into the powered USB hub, which is connected to the Raspberry Pi. As you can see, the Bluetooth dongle is quite tiny, but still it has a sufficient range, so you can use it without any doubts. After plugging the Bluetooth dongle into the USB port, make sure you switch on the power for that port. And then you can turn the open plotter on and check if everything works as expected. The footage is not the best, but here you can see how I am connected with my laptop to the open plotter. Using the instrument panel from Signal K to visualize the wind data from the Calypso wind meter. And I guess that wraps it up. In a future video I'll show you how to establish the Bluetooth connection between open plotter and the wind meter and as well how to extend this setup further. If you've enjoyed the video, please leave a like and if you have any questions, feel free to use the comment section below. Until then, see you in the next video. Bye.